Hey guys, welcome to Safi Mixed. In this video, I will let you know how to convert a Word file into PowerPoint presentation. In order to proceed, first we need to make a little changes to the Quick Access to Toolbar. And for that, you need to click on this down, downward arrow. This window opens and here you need to come to more commands clicking on the more commands this window opens up and you need to uh, click on this drop down window under choose command form and select all commands and then you need to come to send to micro sub powerpoint and click on the add button once you click on the add button the um, send PowerPoint option will be added over here and I you see I have already added it so I'm not pressing the add button but you need to do this and then I click OK button once you click OK button this button would appear in the quick access toolbar and if you uh, place your cursor on this you see it is written send to Microsoft PowerPoint so if I click this button, this Microsoft Word document would be converted to PowerPoint presentation. Let me click this. So the file conversion is started. But uh, you see there is, uh, this is very ugly. It is not what you would be wanting because only this single sentence is placed on the first slide and the rest of the text is taken to the second slide. And that's even not properly distributed. So I don't need this form in, for, in order to present things correctly. I need to make changes in the Word file. And what I do, I select this thing and on the Home tab, come to Style Group and then click on this drop down menu and select Heading. And then I select this text and I again come to the Style Group and I click on heading 1.1 now PowerPoint will convert this thing the, the heading as the title of the slide and this will be placed as the body text of the slide if I now convert this by pressing on this button yes you see now all the things are put on a single slide but I, if I want to create more bullets I need to make a little more changes in the word file so once again I close this without saving and uh, I first select this text I come to the style group and I press unclear formatting and now I put my cursor at this position and I press enter to create a new line then I do the same for another position I put the cursor at this position and add a new line and I repeat the same procedure for this thing now I have four different lines I again select this whole text and I come to the style group click on the drop down menu and select the text as list graph if I now convert this again to PowerPoint presentation and click on this button it will be presented into different bullets the body text is now written in the form of bullets okay I again don't save this file and I cross it out and I make a little more changes in this file I click enter and uh, I want to, to add another slide so what I do I create some dummy text over here by writing random and then one that is one paragraph containing three lines if I enter this this text is created and uh, I want to put this text on a new slide so for that I first click in a blank position and uh, I come to the style group and I click on the drop down menu I and I click on heading one so a heading with just not, uh, uh, representation 2 is added in the file and I again select this text and uh, I come to the style group and I select list paragraph and if now I press on this button to convert this text file to PowerPoint presentation you see now two slides are created the first one is the same as we saw before and this is the second one which have no title because we haven't given a title to this slide and if I want to give a title to this slide I close this without saving and I write here 
this is my second slide and now again if i convert this to powerpoint presentation so the second slide is now also uh, given a title this is my second slide so you see every heading creates a new slide and the text following the heading becomes the body text of the slide now this is one way of creating powerpoint uh, presentation from a word file there is another way let me first close the powerpoint file and now i want to generate uh, the same powerpoint uh, presentation from this file through another way keep in mind i'm keeping the style the same because with this style we can only generate the files so what i do i first create a blank um, powerpoint file i click on the blank presentation and then i come to file menu and then to open file and then i come to browse and on the browse then i go to the position of the file where i have saved it so you do that for your file so here I am in the folder where I have saved my file, but it is not showing over here. So what I next need to do, I come to this part of this window and I click on the arrow and I select all files. If I click this, now the file is shown over here. And if I open this file up, yeah, what you see, uh, it is unable to convert to PowerPoint. Why? Because over here it is written, is currently in use and in the file i'm converting is currently in use so i need to close the file first and it is this file before closing i want to save it and now if i close this file and then click on the open option you see here it is the file is being generated the presentation is being generated and yes we again have the same two uh, slides the first slide to convert to PowerPoint and the second slide is this one so this way you can convert a word file to PowerPoint presentation at the end if you haven't just subscribed to Safi Max can you support the channel by pressing the subscribe button and also the like button on the video thanks for watching